Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> we are live and direct coming to you on so many social platforms. I can't even just say LinkedIn. We here at the Women's Corner, let's talk about it. We're taking our game to the next level by making sure that you all are also finding us regardless of where you are. So we're super excited to be coming to you live. So as you know, we do this room every Thursday. It has been an audio room, but we're trying some things out here. And we want you all to see the faces behind the beautiful voices that you all hear every single week. So if you don't know yet, you are in the Women's Let's Talk About It corner. It is brought to you by the Mom Link. And we are all about elevating, celebrating, and promoting and being that support system for all of us women in business to prove to ourselves that we don't have to do it alone. And while we're in business, understand that there's other issues that come in our ways that we need to discuss, we need to release so that we can be even more productive, more present, because those are the things, it's presence and productive and peace, PPP. That's what we all really <laughs> strive for, right? PP. And you know, <laughs> real. it sounds like what we tell our kids, go PP right now. <laughs> I know. Now, every time you say go PP, you're going to be like productive and present. Productive, present, and persistent. Persistent, there. Productive, present, persistent, and peace. Oh, I added a fourth. Yeah. Because peace, when we have peace in our life, it's like what Mary likes to say. It builds up that harmony. And when we're, it's just like an orchestra. You have different instruments, but they all play in a harmonized sound and it makes it beautiful. You know, as you know, as I just jumped right into it, I didn't even tell you who I was or who she was or who she was because this is who we are, right? And we're super excited to be here. So let me just quickly introduce myself. I see you, Miss Anjali, Mr. Muhammad, Kimberly. Good afternoon, Omar, Sabrina. I want you all to know that this is something new that both Crystal and Mary and myself have both, that's the wrong word, have decided to do together collectively. So if you see any of us looking down, it is us actually responding to you in the comments. We are completely listening. And the biggest thing that we want from all of you all is to engage in the comments. Trust me, you are still a part of this conversation. And we want to ensure that what you have to say is also being addressed because this topic today is a juicy one. Before we get into the topic, I'm going to do a quick introduction to who I am. Pass the mics over. Hey, Miss Danette, we need you over here too, girlfriend, because this is, and I'm going to send you the link too, because Danette is also one of our amazing, amazing strategy queens who will definitely bring so much value to this conversation. So Danette, I'm going to send you right after I do my introduction, I'm going to send you the link to come pop on up, up over here because girlfriend, we need you here too. So my name is Camille Jones and I am the program and educational director in the mom link, as well as the founder of we got this mind and body. And what I do is I am a wellness. I call myself your wellness designer and self image cheerleader. And it's all about encouraging us busy women to start living and prioritizing our health healthy lifestyles. But when I say that, it's through key areas of wellness, not just fitness, not just nutrition, and forget about all that excess workouts and fad diets. It's truly about love and the skin that you are in and celebrating your journey through my customizable online programs. And then on top of that, I am all about the mom link and it's all about women supporting women. And I love be having the opportunity to bring to you all our amazing members and guests fantastic masterclasses, uh, coaching, copy, and everything else in between. Because we here as women have realized that yes, we are strong, we are independent. But when we work together and collectively, we turn into transformers and we take over nations. So that's what we're doing here. So with that, I'm going to pass the mic over to Crystal who's going to do an introduction, then Mary, and then we're going to get right into this conversation. Let's go. All right, Crystal, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sounds good. My name is Crystal Almeida. I am the CEO and founder of The Mom Link, this incredible community, which all three of us are a part of, part of the leadership team, because The Mom Link is what it is today, not because of one woman, not because of two women. It's about a collective of women who truly believe in the power that comes when women choose to support one another. So that is a little bit about me, the mom link community, and what is my jam? My jam is just opening up the door for other female entrepreneurs to come through. No gatekeeping allowed. I want to live in a world where women are in leadership positions. Women are funded for their businesses of their dreams. Women are successfully building sustainable businesses together and are part of a community where in your world, 
women are cheering you on, not competing, but instead completing you. Over to you, Mary. Yes. Hello, everybody. And thank you for being here. We're excited to be bringing this to you because when we are on audio, yeah, we, we get, we, you know, we talk a lot and we share from the heart always, but when we're on video, it's a whole different dynamic because now you get to really see our personalities, our mannerisms, the way that we open up our eyes really big and the crystal's hair just being flipped <laughs> left and right <laughs> and Camille's eyelashes. So my name is Mary Massey. I'm in New Jersey. I'm a personal growth strategist and I'm also a social media coach. What that means is that I help my clients achieve that harmony that Crystal, I'm sorry, Camille talked about before between all the things that you have going on in your life. And as we know, our lifestyle is all about our career, our family, our business, our relationships, mindset, nutrition, and fitness. I've been in the fitness world for almost 15 years now. And that's something that I'm super passionate about is bringing that health and wellness to every aspect of our lives. And as a social media coach, I actually started way back in 2004 with web design and development and heavy video editing. And that's what allows me to really bring that, that sort of expertise to what I do as a coach. So I blended the two together. I'm also the host of the Get Intentional with Mary podcast, and I am the proud director of media for the Mom Link. So I'm looking forward to this conversation. And for those of you who are watching, we, we have you on Facebook, on LinkedIn. We would love to know where it is that you are feeling a little bit challenged with your sales strategy. We did this conversation actually last week on LinkedIn audio. I have the recording. I've been sharing little bits and pieces of it. So make sure that you look out for that on our social media platforms. And it was so valuable. Crystal shared so much. It was the five reasons why we are not selling. Mm -hmm. And because the conversation was basically not finished, we are continuing now. So those of you who are watching who feel a little bit challenged about that, pop in your questions in the comments. Mm -hmm. And um, let's go. Let's go. Uh, who's next? Camille, Crystal? Yeah, I'm going to just quickly jump in here and say, uh, Danette, I, I sent you a message on LinkedIn Messenger with the link to come in. Danette is one of our amazing members in the mom link, just like us. And she is what we call the strategy queen, the strategy lady. And for this conversation that, you know, Crystal brought to the limelight last week, it was so powerful, so uh, impactful that we had to bring it back. And what it also made it great was we, because we have a community of diverse women from all walks and, and talks of, of, of places and stages, uh, you know, Danette coming in and bringing in that real meat of understanding the power of having that strategy, that business plan, that systems, it really brought so much more value to the conversation. And we here in the women's Let's Talk About a Corner, we're all about having our voices heard because when we get our voices heard, we're able to show our perspectives as well as be able to educate and uplift others. So I see you, Miss Latoya, so grateful to have you here. I tried to go on to, to talk into the, the, the chat, but I am this again, we are a work in progresses, but of course masterpieces at the same time. And as we start building ourselves up, we'll we will have a lot better seeming streamline of how we're going to be talking onto the chat. So if any of you all know how to get into the chat, definitely Crystal or Mary slide in there because I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, but anyways, yeah, I'm looking at the comments here, Camille. So you're good. And Perfect. ladies, ladies, anybody watching right now, or if you're going to be watching the replay, we've streamed on so many different channels. This is called Women's Talk Corner. So yes, it's myself, Mary and Camille, but we want you to jump on Women's uh, Let's Talk About It Corner with us because this is all about different women, different walks of life, different perspectives, and sharing all of our wealth of knowledge and areas of expertise that we can bring to this incredible community of women supporting women. So if you're interested, drop in the comments, drop in the chat right now, let us know. I would love to be on Women's Talk Corner with you. Uh, mm -hmm. We would love to have you. And, and you know exactly what, what you say, Crystal. I just want to say one thing: we are not stingy with uh, with uh, with um of having the present. I mean, with the information as well as highlighting others. So that is a huge opportunity. If you want, not even if you want to, it's time to come out of our your comfort zone and come and join us in the women's. Let's talk about a corner. Yes, yes, yes. 
And you know what, ladies, I was just thinking, okay, next week I'm going to challenge us, Mary and Camille. We're mm. each, we're not going to introduce ourselves. We are going to show this community the power of being a part of a group of women supporting women mm. and how I could intro you, Mary, and provide a killer intro for you. I could do the same thing for you, Camille. And I know you ladies could do it for each other and for me. So next week I challenge the three of us to not intro ourselves, but intro each other so we can demonstrate yeah. three women who are truly walking the talk of women supporting women uh, through just knowing you ladies and not just each other, right? We do that for women in our community uh, all the time. So let's jump right into this because I know there's some people wanting to hear. And just one quick one because you guys can't see. Danette is coming in, so I'm going to throw her up here. But let's get into the conversation. And then when we get to Danette, she could tell us who she is and then add into this conversation because this is going to be a hot one. So I hope you all have your pen and paper. And if you don't have your pen and paper, get a recording, get that pen and paper because it's going to be a juicy one. Let's do this. All right. Okay. And now put some thick skin on because what I'm about to say on the reason why you are not selling may hurt a little. It might sting. It may hurt, but bear with me. It will feel good. Danette, you're going to love this one. All right. Number one reason you are not selling. Two things, brains and effort. Brains mm -hmm. and effort. And now when I say brains, I don't mean you have to be a, you know, super intellect. I'm not telling you you have to already be an expert at building business and an expert at selling. When I say brains, are you seeking the knowledge? Are you doing the homework? Are you educating yourself? And I'm not talking about when I say brains and effort, I put them together. Because in order to get the brains, you got to put the effort in. Yeah. And it's super easy. There's knowledge all over the place. Mm -hmm. And you can go on YouTube. You can learn about sales. You can learn about marketing, whatever it is that you want to. But are you putting in the effort? Are you just watching a quick YouTube video that took you five minutes to watch, but it didn't actually teach you how to mm -hmm. sell? Or are you actually investing in yourself? Go to, the, go to your local college. And I'm not telling you you need to go and take a whole degree in sales or marketing. But I'm telling you, you need to absorb the knowledge into selling and you need to put that effort in there. So go to your local college, pay $90, pay $100, whatever it costs you, take a course on basic accounting, take a course on sales, take a course on marketing your product or service, but do the work, put in the effort so you can bring brains to the table. And I'll tell you why, because every single industry is saturated. Mm. And, you know, we all hear that all the time. Oh, I'm mm -hmm. not selling because my industry is saturated. Mm -hmm. Is that really why you're not selling? Mm -hmm. I would probably say no. Every single industry is saturated, right? Mm -hmm. But how many people do we have in this world? I'm not good with that. I don't know how many. Eight billion. As of, as of two months ago, eight billion. I love that you just knew that off the top. Right? <laughs> I do. <laughs> well, eight billion people. Your industry is not saturated. There are people who are not being served by your products or services or the skills you have to share with the world. So what is going on? Why are you not selling? Why aren't you reaching those people who are not being serviced by you? Simple. It's the brains. It's the knowledge. You need to have more knowledge than anybody else in your, satura in your saturated industry. You need to be the expert. You need to have the knowledge and you need to be ahead of the game. You know, in the mom link, we talk about no, no competition. We just collaborate. So collaboration over competition. But that's not, that's not us telling you to not go and be competitive in your industry. You need to be. You need to gain the skills. You need to gain the knowledge. You need to put in the effort. And you need to be the most knowledgeable individual in your industry if you want to be ahead of the sales game, if you want to make those sales happen in your business. So like I said, my tip for today that do not forget about it is brains and knowledge and effort. It takes effort to sell. If all you do is put effort on learning how to sell, guess what? You're gonna sell. Gonna sell. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Uh, can I add to that? Because I, I really wanted to, to, to even expand on that knowledge part. And it, it just made me think about this. We also need to understand that how we did a business in the past may not be the way you have to do it in the future or your new line. So I also here in Toronto have a brick and mortar. We sell appliances. And, you know, we've been in this industry for almost 10 years. I'm killing it. And I was like, I could go online and do my wellness. I know what I got. I just, I was trying to copy what I thought I knew and learned in my brick and mortar 
into my online. And let me tell you something, I crashed and burned really fast. So I, it wasn't until I connected with individuals like Danette, like when I went, there's the things that she knows, I didn't even, didn't even come across my brain, like systems. What are you talking about? Automation? Huh? Strategy? What? I just thought I had to just go and sell and everybody would just buy. So I agree with you that we need to build up the knowledge of our industry and how are we going to better market it within our industry? Because even that marketing knowledge is huge. So investing in yourself is key. And there's so much times that we don't do it because we'll find like, all these excuses and say that we could do it on our own. But of course we can, but at what cost to our mental health, to our financial wealth, mm -hmm. and for our even our, our perseverance to continue on. So I just wanted to add that on. Um, and other yeah. than continue to hear what you have to say. So I think, um, yeah, so I, I agree. I definitely agree with that, Crystal and Camille, because you have to know your product. You have to know what you're doing. You have to know what you're offering. We can have all the knowledge in the world when it comes to the book type of knowledge, but there's also understanding how to communicate, knowing how to communicate, knowing how to be charismatic, knowing how to have people really tune in and listen to you, knowing how to attract. Mm -hmm. I love the concept of attraction marketing so much. And that's what I like to do because when you think about selling, sometimes people say, oh, I got to go and sell. No, you are putting yourself out there. You're attracting your the, the right type of consumer, the right type of yeah. client by sharing what you know, sharing your expertise in a way that is charismatic, in a way that makes you approachable. So you are attracting. So think of it this way, you know, like we talked about earlier in Breakfast with Champions and thank you, Crystal, for letting me do that. We talked about attraction marketing and using social media to do that. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't really matter if you have a brick and mortar, if you have a bakery, if you are somebody who's a pet walker, it doesn't really matter. You have to have the knowledge and what you, what it is that you're doing. You have to have that belief in yourself. And you also have to understand your potential client, your mm -hmm. ideal audience and put yourself in their shoes so that when you create your content, so that when you're speaking, you are already speaking to what it is that they need. Not only that, but you also have to learn how to listen as well and look at what it is that people are asking you for already. What are the questions that they tend to ask? How mm -hmm. is it that they are posting questions online? What is it? There's so much that goes into it that it's important for us first to have that foundation, you know, your knowledge, your skill set. If you don't necessarily have a certain skill set that you need in order to sell, you need to learn that get a mentor, get a coach, and then put it into practice. Mm -hmm. Because without putting it into practice, without taking action, and I'm guilty of this for many years, all I did was absorb, absorb, absorb. And quite honestly, ladies, it wasn't until maybe this past year, year and a half that I began to pour it all out. Because there's no growth without sharing what we know. And when we begin to share what we know, that's when we begin to attract the right people. That's when our tribe begins to find us. And that's when finally the sale happens. Mm -hmm. right? So just wanted to add that. Mary, Let's, throw it down to Mary. The, Let's throw it down to the strategy lady. Go, Jeanette. Jeanette. Please do I'm a quick sitting. intro and then tell us, strategize what we've been talking about. Put us in our place and let's go. I don't even have to put you in a place because you ladies are on it. And as you can see, I'm outside, out and about as a busy mom of five and one getting ready to graduate. So I wasn't able to be at my desk. But I still wanted to show up because I knew this was going to be a meaty, meaty and meaty topic. Mm -hmm. I'm Danette Moss, business systems and implementation strategist, a.k.a. the strategy lady. Mm -hmm. And I am who I am is because I came from a space of no order, unorganized, chaotic. All of that stuff that we're talking about that some of you, each of you all kind of touched on. I had to go and get in order for me to maintain and have the success that I'm now starting to have in my business. And it just continues to grow. Thinking back about what, what Mary just said, you know, that having that, being that charismatic person, that person that draws people to you. You know why I draw people to me? It's because I'm real and I show y'all the nasty, the dirty and all of the stuff. <laughs> I, don't, I don't try to be fake or phony and make you seem like it's all perfect. I'm real because I know what it's like to be unorganized. I know what it's like to be overwhelmed and I know what it's like to not have what I need and to do as Crystal said, if you don't know it, 
Danny, maybe you might have to go get it. Maybe you might have to go get some training. Maybe you may need to nurture some things of areas that you think you know, as uh, Camille said. She came from the brick and mortar. She had all of that. But she had to learn how to do things differently. Mm -hmm. So just understanding that not every situation is going to be a cookie cutter. Mm -hmm. But you can, you can position this thing called business ownership, moms in business, doing all the things that you need to do in such a way that it will draw people to you. First and foremost, be real. Let the people know that you are just like them. And in a nutshell, I'm kind of two steps in front of you. Everything that you're probably going through, I've either been through, mm -hmm. and let me tell you how you can get around it. And mm -hmm. in my belief is that you need processes and systems. But going back to what Crystal said earlier, if there is something that you lack and you don't know how to do it, be humble enough to say you don't know how to do it and go get it. There's enough of us here, especially in the modeling community. If it's a mindset issue that I'm struggling with, there's somebody here I can get it from. Mm -hmm. If it's an issue with showing up in social media, needing help with how to do reels and know how to position myself on social media, there's Mary. If I'm a mom who is sluggish and tired and I'm just lazy, I know my weight has a lot to do with it. I know I'm not eating good. There's Camille that can help me get myself together because, you know, the reality is if I don't have all of these core areas Mm -hmm. And a place to go and network and to be with other women, such the environment modeling that Crystal set up, then I'm going to be all over the place. I need good help in order for me to have the wealth. I need to be visible. So I need Mary. I need to have a network of women that are like minded like me. So there's Crystal with the mom link. And then you need somebody like the strategy lady that will help you go from overwhelmed to putting your business on rinse and repeat. These are processes, these are systems that set us up for the sale. And if we don't have these things in order, you won't be able to sell because your mind is going to be all over the place. And you just won't be able to do what you need to do. Y'all know if I had that plane to land my plane over here on LinkedIn, I would do that. I'm going to go ahead and pause my mic. Dan Danette, I have a question for you. Okay, so uh, you heard from Danette, but just a quick little proper introduction. Um, one thing you need in business to be successful without a doubt, and it's part of your foundation, is a CRM system. You mm -hmm. need a system to run and operate your business. Yes. Now, my question for you, Danette, is I know people come to you and they want you to set up their funnel for them, set up a landing page for them, set up their sales process for them, which you do and you offer that service, right? Um, but would you say that a part of why people are not um, selling is because they're not willing to do the work and learn how to run their own system. Mm. We're in this oh ownership mm. that mm. everybody wants paid for mm. you, done for you services. And what mm. I realized is you can pay an accountant. You can mm -hmm. pay somebody to run your funnel. But then when the money runs out, when that person has done the job, <laughs> they've left, here's your funnel, and you want to duplicate, you want to repurpose, you want to clone that funnel. You have no idea how to do it. So now you have to go back and pay somebody again. Yeah. And so, Danette, I want to throw that as a question to you, because um, I know you see this specifically in your field of work. And I believe this is part of the block on why people can't sell, because they're not willing to actually learn and they want done for you services. Done. Let me tell you, I'm smiling because I have somebody very close to me that is struggling with that. Have paid upwards of $30,000 in their business. Gave money to somebody else. <laughs> Not to me. And I'm right close to them. To get all these different things. And I don't have time for that. I'm going to do this this way. I need to do it this way. And although they had good intentions because they had the money to do it. I'm not mad. Right? But they did not get, they weren't intimate with their own business. Mm. You have to know your business. Mm -hmm. We are all in our new normal right now. And that new normal is, we know what happened a couple mm. years ago, right? And there was a lot of money out there. A lot of people had it. They had junior admins. They had VAs. Some VAs died. Some VAs left them. And they were stuck having to do this thing called business themselves. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And because they lacked the knowledge and the understanding and didn't have clarity of their business because they had gotten so spoiled and so used to other people doing business for them. They didn't know their business. As business owners, Crystal, you're so right. You have to know your business. Oh, we lost the net for a sec. Yeah. Oh, this is you, 
my, my alarm clock jumped up. You had better be intimate with your business. If you're not intimate with your business, how are you going to know when things are right or when things are wrong? Yeah. How are you going to know what it is that you truly need to give someone else? You're, you're crackling you a little bit, Danette. Danette, you're uh -oh. crackling a little bit. Yeah, something happened once your alarm went. Yeah. It Maybe mute yourself and unmute and see if the, the issue is still there. Try it again. All right. Is it there now? Is that better? Mm -hmm. No, it's still there. All right. Let me let me okay. add on to that. See if you can cut out and come back in and maybe the alarm just yeah. Comes come back out bit. and I'll bring yes. you back. One thing that I always made it a point to that. do, even like way back in the day when I was designing and doing all these websites for my clients, mm -hmm. I always gave them full control, full access to everything that they had. And one of the reasons why was because some of the clients would come and say, oh, so and so did this for me and now I can't get a hold of them and they now they own your domain name. Now they own your, your hosting. They own everything. So here's the thing. I understand that running a business is very challenging. I understand, of course, that having a social media platform, creating content, setting up an email list, all of these things, setting up a funnel, having a strategy and a system, it's challenging. But mm -hmm. if you blindly hand your money to someone, and it happens so many times, you're going to lose control without understanding mm -hmm. what the steps are. So for me, it's always important to make sure that there is that coaching session where you guide somebody and say, this is what I'm going to do for your business. This is the step-by-step -step process. Understand what it takes to put yourself mm -hmm. out there. Because if you are blindly putting your faith and your money in someone else, you're never going to get it. You don't understand the ins and outs of your business. You don't know where the money's coming from, how your Stripe account is set up. Oh, I have mm -hmm. no idea how the PayPal. And I, I just had a conversation with somebody recently about this. Oh, I don't know how to do this. I'm like, you have to understand how to do it. Because before you know it, your entire business will crumble because mm -hmm. someone else knows more than you do. And you're supposed to know more about the business than that person that you're hiring. You're hiring the help. You're not hiring somebody to do it all for you. We got to understand that. So that was a great share uh, from Danette, by the way. Hopefully we can get her back. It yeah, was, Danette's a powerhouse. Let's just say, ladies, let, let's say it out loud. Let's say it out loud. This is going to be painful. It's going to hurt. Ouch. Don't be lazy. Stop being lazy. Even when it comes to like social media, Mary, I got to I throw this at you too. As the same kind of question. Social media, people who are like, oh, I don't know how to do reels. I can't figure it out. What do you mean? Yeah, well, well that how? right there, Crystal. <laughs> they didn't the, do the work. They the language. The language. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm I'm not techie. I'm so low tech. Change the language. Period. And, and Mary, let's just say, like right now, I'm gonna open up that Instagram app. What do you mean you don't know how? You have the same access to information and tools on your Instagram as I do. I just play around. I hit the plus button, see what happens. Now I know what the plus button is for, right? And mm -hmm. I don't mean to say it this way, but if you're a female entrepreneur, this is me saying it like your mom's giving you like you know, giving you the shit, but giving you the love, right? And it's like, do the work, stop being lazy. You need to learn your own systems. You don't know how to do reels. Don't go pay somebody to do the reel for you. Figure it out. And if you can't or, figure it out and you need, yeah, join the mom link because we'll train you and we'll show you how to do it. You Hold on, you guys just see that? All I said was or, or. and she, she finished my sentence. <laughs> do you see the synergy? Because all I said was or, and that's exactly what I was going to say. Because let's just, I'm just going to put a shameless plug right now for all of our members that are part of the mom link. We are having an amazing masterclass tonight at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time that Miss Mary over there, as well as another amazing lady, uh, Michelle Steiner, is going to teach us how to not only set up Pinterest, learn to monetize it, mix in with Canva. There's no excuses because we have it right at our fingertip. And it's so true, Crystal. Let's stop saying we can't, we can't, we can't. Mm -hmm. Change that language to yes, I can, yes, I can. And you'll see how the universe will start popping up. Hey, oh my gosh, that masterclass, let me go into it. It will start encouraging you to take more action mm -hmm. on your the things that you thought you can't. Just like the little engine that could. I think I can, I think I can. That's what we got to start yeah. doing. And we got Jeanette right. right back up here. Let's get into, we are at 1234 and we have a huge yeah. giveaway to go on to. I don't even know if we got onto to top, I mean, step number oh four. Oh my five. gosh. We haven't even talked about the giveaway. So who wants to, who wants to talk about that and what's included? Or should we do that a little bit? Let's get to another step first. Okay. Because of the yeah. timing. Yeah, we can, we can oh. definitely do that. So Crystal, go ahead. 
All right. I think the last one that we can all tap into, and it's huge and we'll all agree with it, is the mindset around selling. Mm -hmm. I think we've seen a shift in the culture and the mindset around selling. And mm -hmm. it is no longer cool. It is no longer like in fashion, you would say, to say, oh, I'm different than those coaches. I'm not trying to make money. Mm -hmm. I'm doing this because I love what I do. No, no, no. You love what you do, but you're trying to make money. Like, let's just let's put be it real. Let's be real, yeah. right? You're in, do, running your business and building the business of your dreams, not because you want to be poor. You don't want to like not make money. You want to generate money. And you are offering up your skill and your expertise to the world for an exchange of money. Let's be honest and real about that. So when you're going around selling and you're not direct selling, because I think direct selling was a thing of the past. And then we moved away from that. And then we were trying to sell without selling. And there was a lot of training on that. Sell without selling. No, no, no. Sell to sell. Talk about money. Talk about that you're trying to sell. Like, don't be yes. afraid. Don't shy away from it. Don't get paranoid if people are going to think, oh, she's too salesy. No, be really direct about it. You know, when you buy something on Instagram, I don't know about you ladies, but I am awful. I buy so much random stuff off Instagram <laughs> and they're directly selling. Buy this today only, $19.99. Yeah. I'm like, oh, got to buy that yeah. now. I know all of us. <laughs> Most of the yeah. time when we buy things and Camille's laughing because she's like a cereal or a cereal. <laughs> and it's like, yeah, sorry. I just have to come on. You know, every time I make it, I want to make a purchase now. I have to call Crystal because I will just be like, shiny, click, shiny, click. Crystal will be like, yes. Camille, you already have Please, it. let me tell you something about that. Y'all are clicking here and clicking there and spending money on things that you don't need when you should be investing in yes. your knowledge, investing in networking opportunities and collaboration opportunities. Because let me tell you, people are more than happy to drop $300 for a pair of shoes. But mm -hmm. if you say to them, okay, my coaching an hour with me is $300, let's say, oh yeah, I, I need to, I need to talk to my spouse or yeah, it's not in the budget now. Meanwhile, they're posting all the selfies with the expensive stuff that they buy priorities. <laughs> you, know, you have a business. I'm just going to say it, you know, it's true. It's an investment. You're not spending money. You are investing your time. You are investing your money into your growth. And somebody said having a growth mindset, I'm a personal growth strategist, okay? It's not just about the social media. For me, it's about getting you to the place where you actually have the right mindset to do the thing that you need to do for your business, for your family. So there's a lot that goes into it. So think about it that way now. You are investing in your business. You're investing mm -hmm. your time. No more getting lazy, no more uh, scrolling frivolously through Instagram and buying the $10 thing here or the $1,000 thing there, because you need to put that into something that's actually going to, you know, make you money. Very, very. Oh, oh, listen, I hope y'all can hear me because you all are taking me to church here today on this platform because you're being real about just where we really are. You know, having the squirrel mentality, mm. having the... Oh, I'm just buying these things that you never use. You know, all these key things are important, but investing back into yourself is key. Um, I had recently spoke at a sales summit and I was like, me at a sales summit? I'm not a salesperson, right? But God put me in that position where someone saw me speaking when I went live for 31 days every day. Mm. Someone on LinkedIn saw me speaking and they invited me to the sales summit. And in that particular at that time I didn't know what I was going to speak about and then I was blessed from God with the sales equation and guess what the sales equation dealt with it it dealt with lead magnet that still sells mm. what type of lead magnet was I really going to have that I can give to someone that was going to be uh oh her alarm uh, uh, your alarm that alarm needs to stop can you hear me now are you awake are you aren't you awake already well, my alarm was set for me to remember to be with you all because I was trying to get into what I was trying to do, right? I just set those alarms because now I'm being pulled everywhere just from speaking and it's a blessing. But what I was saying literally was I had to think about sales not being the way that the way Crystal was saying. I love the inbound effect. I love drawing people to me. That means i got to give something of value. It has to be something that you can utilize in your business or in your life right away. Mm. Even if you, even if it was free, yeah. lead yep. magnet should be something of value. Mm -hmm. Then after I give that something of the value, now it's in the communications or the conversation, right? Mm. The how up. am I really, in, 
engaging with that person, all the different things that I'm mm. doing to make sure, understanding that my conversation and my communications is tied into that thing of value, right? That I gave them in the lead magnet, whether it's a email, whether it's a, 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 a system strategy call, no matter what it is, you, that individual person needs to walk away knowing that they've been served yes. and that they've been served well so when we deal with that, lead magnet of value, when we deal with the second part of the communications and the or the conversations, now guess what it, it positions me for? Conversion. Mm. Now I can I can deal with the conversion. How can I deal with that conversion piece? We just had a good conversation and I communicated well, right? Now I'm thinking about the customer journey through this whole experience and mm. I've sewn in it to them it's setting me up now to deliver. Mm. That's how I look at sales. Yeah. I look at it as my my lead magnet because you didn't know me until you saw me somewhere, whether it was Clubhouse, yeah. whether it was me it going down in the DM, all of that stuff, how I communicated with them, how I spoke or how I provided yeah. a solution to their pain point, mm. not just knowing the pain point, but I have a solution for their pain point to be able to help them. It set me up to be able to convert them, pull them from Clubhouse, pull them from Mom Link's community, pull them from when I'm out somewhere networking face to face, because now I can deliver. And to me, it's all about that. Y'all know I can go on this topic all day long. I'm gonna pause that mic again. No, I, I love what you said. I just wanted to add to that. And then we got to, we're gonna talk about our um, giveaway. But what I love what you said, Danette, and what, what Crystal and what Mary, what we're seeing and what I've really learned in business too, and especially after this pandemic, I know when we were initially in the pandemic, we were just buying, buying, buying every, every shiny thing. But what I've learned from now being in a common unity, a community, is, is that when I do my investments in myself with people that have a genuine in, 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 interest in me, that genuinely want to see me win, no longer do I feel like as if I'm just getting something that's evergreened or something that is generic or standard or cookie cutter. See what, what Danette said is like she works for the solution for that individual, per, individual person. And that's one thing I've learned in business. Before, I was buying into programs because of the name of the person, just because of the name. But did that person really have the genuine interest and vested time to yeah. really understand my own pain points within my business? No, they didn't. It was a business for them. Mm -hmm. So that's another thing too, is that really getting to, to being a part of, of spaces and places that really truly want to see you win, not just make that dollar sign. And I wanted to add one last thing is the power of consistency, the power of showing up all the time, even when the sales are low. You, they, they, your viewers don't know, your, your environment doesn't know, but how you show up and being consistent, it all, that consistency is key. And that goes with everything that we do, right? And then I really wanted to emphasize that and even showing up for ourselves consistently. You know, even outside. Like e even, even when you're outside and you'd rather be at your desk. Exactly. You say you're gonna, uh, when you say you're going to before you go, is vet the people that you are investing with. Yes. That part too. Yeah. You need that to vet part. because there's a lot of times where you could be investing again, the name. And then in actuality, you go and look at and like the name is actually the name you don't want to be associated. Or is it somebody that actually could does know what they're talking about? Or are they selling us a story? So you are very right. We need to vet. And you know what? We got to still show up. I'm going to keep it real. My ladies down here know what's happening with me right now. She's got the vid. I got the vid right now. I am full fledged COVID central right here. <laughs> right, right now, I definitely, I, I'm, I'm, I have COVID right now. To be honest with y'all, mm -hmm. but the way how I see it is, COVID is not going to hold me back. Still COVID showing up. It's not going to do anything to me. Uh, yeah, after I come off of this call, I'm going to go take a shower and, and because I'm sweating and all that kind of stuff. But nobody yeah. needs to know that. It's about showing up and being consistent and having the true knowing that what your value brings is beneficial to others and knowing that you have support system that you're not doing it alone in the sales. So, you know, you show up no matter what. You show up with a root canal being done or whatever your dental <laughs> stuff was. You show up with the vid. Listen, I got to show up because you keep showing up no matter what. And this is what common unity, as you say, community is all about. 
Yeah. You know, I, I just, I so appreciate you ladies because listen, if I'm not showing up, I know y'all will go find me and go, what's up? Damn Skippy. And Jesus. you know what? I take that back. I mean, I, I, I send that, that energy back to all of you ladies because of you ladies, I, I always say this time last year, I was by myself. I didn't even think of, of if I was coming or going, but because I have that community, that accountability, that support, you know, the times where I felt like as if like yesterday in our room, I was feeling down until I got into, onto the onto our room. And then you know what? The energy, the, the, the synergy reminded me that I got this and this is my business and I'm going to sell because of the amazing vibration and synergy here. And I love it. So thank you all for showing up for yourselves because when you show up for yourself, you're showing up for others and you don't know how much more it benefits us all collectively. And Wait, with that, I wish I you could say, let, me, let me jump in yeah. and just say two really quick tips that I want to share with everybody watching. And it goes off of Danette. Danette, I spoke about you behind your back this morning, just so you know, <laughs> uh, but always in good ways. Right. And I used you as an example. <coughs> Danette, you show up consistently all the time. Just like Camille said, you are in my face on my social media platforms all the time. There is no way I don't know what you do because you're mm. constantly just talking about what you do. <laughs> and one of the reasons, so here's my tip, tip number three, uh, why you're not selling because you're becoming a serial entrepreneur because you're talking about 17 different things, trying to sell 17 different things. Stick to one thing, ladies, get good at that before you move on. People who have multi or multiple businesses and are successful in all their businesses, they actually focused on one business, making it successful. Then you move on to the next. Danette shows up and is consistent. And all she talks about is systems and strategies, systems and strategies. When anybody in our community wants somebody from systems and strategies, they're like, oh, yeah, the strategy lady, Danette, because she shows up every single damn day about the same thing all the time. Number two tip that Danette does and demonstrates that I watch you do, you do not gatekeep. Gatekeeping is stopping you from selling. Stop thinking that if I give all the secrets, they're not going to want to hire me as a coach. You're wrong. Give all your secrets, give all your value, and then they're going to be like, holy crap, I got that for free? I can't imagine what I'm going to get if I pay for it. So no, that right there. No That's gatekeeping and be in your face. And here's the last little like... Um, no shame in my game share. Mary Massey, I'm going to stop purchasing from Instagram, but it's because they're doing what Danette does. They show up on my feet every single day. Look at everybody knows this cream. What's this? This is called, oh, be thick, be thick. Is that that skin tightening crab app? Yeah. Maybe. Of course you have that. They're on everybody's Instagram. I just show you the product. Everybody knows. Oh yeah. I don't, don't, I don't know. In the comments, they're like, did it work? Crystal? Did it work? Tell us, did it work? No, it, it well, no, it didn't really work. <laughs> Anyways, they were in my face every single day on my social media uh, feed. I know they're on your face. Number two, they tell you the technology on how they made this. They tell you why it works. They don't gatekeep. So no gatekeeping. Um, seek knowledge, become the expert in your field, and you are the expert in understanding your industry and uh, niche. Put in the effort, do the work, and be consistent. So I had to share those tips. Let's talk about the giveaway. Jeanette. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> Listen, I, I know you can make going to the giveaway because time is of the essence, but you just had me smile. Mm -hmm. And I can say the reason why I'm up here on this stage is because I was in your face, is because I showed up, mm -hmm. is because I I, I stayed in and I was consistent, yeah. is because I didn't operate with a spirit of perfection, but I operated just from a space of just understanding the, the pain point and knowing the solution, mm -hmm. right? And I, and I truly believe that that put me in a position of real life case study vetting. Yeah. You all know that I'm real. I'm not fake. I've been through it. I'm going through it. And girl, I can help you do the same thing. And so I appreciate you for just sharing that, Crystal. Thanks so much. And the last part for you too, Danette, you, you, you missed one key part that you, that is so amazing about the, the woman that you are is everything that you do. Not only is it genuine, but you don't come into any space or place with this competitive mindset. You are always willing to give, even in the same industry, you know, you're not, you're not looking to, to, to give, to get something in return. And you know what? We all know how that works when you, Good karma by just showing up for yourself always comes back to you. So I want to say that to you, Danette. I've never, to, I don't think I've ever said that to you personally, but your, your commodity 
is 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 I'm telling you, we have to save forever because I need to know more about how to 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 do all my stuff with even my Aww. kids because I respect you so very much and on the Thank business you. level and personal. So much. Thanks yeah. so much. There's always somebody else that's doing the same thing we're doing. So I may not be your judge. You may be somebody else's judge. But hey, we can collaborate. Let's make this thing happen. Thanks yeah. so much, Camille. <laughs> All right, Miss Mary. I know Mary's trying to say, let's get conversation. Come convert. I mean, talking about this giveaway because at 1 p.m., we didn't say it, but we have a Connect and Collab room coming up in 10 minutes on the LinkedIn. We are going to truly use this LinkedIn space with intention. So let's get to this giveaway and then we're going to get into that Connect and Collab room. All right, let's go. So our giveaway is today. We announced it last week. It's our, it was our Mother's Day belated Mother's Day giveaway. So what we are doing in the spirit of no gatekeeping and sharing all the wonderful things that we have to offer, of course, we are giving away. This is the, the maybe I'll save the, the top, top, top thing for, for later. So I am personally giving, it, giving away a 90 minute strategy session for social media. And that is going to include me sitting on Zoom with you, plugging in my phone and walking you through everything that you need to know to set up your social media the right way, have the right foundation, because it is the first step in your sales funnel. So we're going to talk about strategy. We're going to talk about how to create content, how to do it in a way that does not overwhelm you, in a way that actually complements your lifestyle. So we're going to do that. That's what I'm giving away. Our ambassador, one of our ambassadors, TC, is going to be giving away 10 hours of virtual uh, assistant help. So that's 10 hours that can help you with whatever it is that you have going on in your business, whether it's writing emails or posting for, for you on social media. She's also giving away 25% off her intensives. Those are her 90 minute workshops. And she has these workshops on different topics from email automation to strategy to sales funnels, like all the things. So that's something that she is giving away. She's one of our newest ambassadors. And lastly, and this is the big one, are you ready? <laughs> yeah. Oh, are you guys commenting here? Can you like let us know you're alive? Let us know if you're <laughs> if you're still here with us, if you can hear us. And even if it's on the replay, still because yes. we'll check this as well. And we'll also put in some more information afterwards into the comments. So this is also goes for the replay listeners as well. Comment. Mary, Mary when you get finished, I got a giveaway that I can throw into the pot too if y'all want. Maybe we need wow. to use that as ammo for two weeks from now. Mm -hmm. Well, Danette, Danette, actually, Mary Massey came up with a genius idea. Because we're a community and we're a collective, uh, we are going to do a giveaway brought to you by the Mom Link and our community members every single month. And so we're going to highlight someone different, a member or an ambassador. So if you're a member of the Mom Link and you want to grow on social media, get some more attention, get some more following, but not do it alone, let us know. DM us, drop something in the comments, say, hey, I want in on a giveaway partnership and uh, we'll collab with you on the next giveaway. Right, Mary? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, people will be so, so blessed to have you, Danette. So thank you for offering that. That's awesome. All right. So the big one. And, you know, we've been talking about the mom link and everything that we offer as a you know, the leadership and also as a community and all the support that you get. And I'm just going to say this because it's not just about the classes and the networking and collaborating and the going live with each other. It goes a lot deeper than that. It's about really having community and having somebody that will support you psychologically, emotionally, because being an entrepreneur is not easy. Having a business, it's really hard for your family to understand, for your friends to understand what goes on up here when you're a business owner and all the things that you have to go through. So with that being said, we are giving away a full year membership to the mom link. So I think, I think that's extremely generous <laughs> and I'm very, very happy and blessed to be part of a community that actually wants to give more. And that's what is helping us to grow. So I'm, I'm proud of it really. Uh, Crystal and Camille and and Danette for being here and and for for this for the fact that we're able to give this away to somebody who wants to grow their business and needs that kind of support. Absolutely, and you know the Mom Link uh, annual membership for our Tier One membership is a thousand dollars regularly. So we're giving this away for complete uh, completely for free in this giveaway. And just know because we understand as a new entrepreneur, maybe that thousand dollars is difficult to come across for your, an annual membership. And I'll tell you, we 
get, are giving away an annual membership and not a monthly membership um, because we're not going to lie to you. It's not going to take you a month to build your business. It's not going to take you two months to be making those sales. It's not going to take you three or four or five months. Don't let anybody tell you that. You're going to need to invest in yourself, do the work and participate for a whole year. But I promise you. So if you're going to enter this giveaway, be serious, be ready to invest in yourself and be ready to do the work and put in the effort. Don't take this opportunity away from anybody else. Enter the giveaway if you're serious about investing in yourself and having a women like all of these ladies uh, there to celebrate you, cheer you on, pick you up when you need it most. Enter that giveaway. Head over to our LinkedIn mom link page you can enter the giveaway there we're about to announce the winner in one hour in our networking room on on linkedin as well at one o'clock so we're starting in five minutes our famous connect and collab networking room on linkedin for women and female entrepreneurs uh, to find new connections and collaborations uh, for their business so make sure you're joining us over there on linkedin make sure you enter that giveaway and uh, keep joining us here every Thursday at noon EST uh, for Let's Talk About It Corner with uh, some incredible females. <laughs> Good job, ladies. <laughs> yes, oh, I was just on speaker. And yes, we're going to go from audios to lies. I think we're going to start moving more towards lies because we want you all to see that we are all the real deal. Exactly what Danette said. We keep it real with the peeps on, on the streets always. And the best way that we could do that is by looking at us face to face, right? So we are very excited to continue on with the women's Let's Talk About a Corner. If you want to come up on here too, let's talk about it. Come in, slide into our DMs. You want to get that strategy going, you slide into Danette's DMs as well. Like, come on, it's time to take action. You want to get your socials going on? See Mary right there? Slide into her DMs. You want to get into your wellness and understand that you are the controller of everything? Slide into my DM. And I know you are ready to join a common unity, an amazing community. The mom link, slide into any one of our DMs and we got you. So can't wait. So I think we are going to our, our um, LinkedIn mm -hmm. um, Connect and Collab. We mm -hmm. are. We're headed there now, ladies. Um, we're going to rock out with a little bit of Janet Jackson here. Join us on LinkedIn and get your body moving. Let's go, you know, Even if you have COVID, you can still move. Just do this. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Thank you for tuning in. P.S. Little little fun fact about me. I'm going to go see Janet next Tuesday. Ooh. All right, now. <laughs> Bye, ladies. The mom link if you don't belong. <laughs> <laughs>